Hello YouTube, this is the Computer Tips and welcome back to part 5 of my video series on how to create a sales report in Microsoft Excel. Now for this uh, we're going to be basically aligning a lot more of the um, rows and we're going to make this look a lot nicer than what it currently looks now. So first thing we want to do is we want to select from A1 all the way to G1 then we're going to want to click merge and center right here then we want to do the same thing for this bottom row merge and center next we want to go to cell style and we want to click title here we're going to want to click heading 1 Alright, and next we want to pick the month and hold down control. Go down here from A4. Basically, you're going to want to select B3 or G3 and then hold down control and select A4 to A8. And next we want to go to cell style and pick heading 4 alright and next we want to now we're going to then um, go here select these top rows right here I'm going to select the accounting format which is the dollar sign. It's going to basically change all this to dollar sign. Then we want to select B5 to F7. And we're going to select the comma style to get the numbers of comma. Make them fit nicely. And next, we want to give this the style of total. So let's go into cell style. Find total. There we go. Now this is looking a lot better than when we first started, but um, there's probably a few more changes we can do to it. So the next thing I'm going to do is um, I'm going to actually change the theme. You don't have to. I'm going to pick a random one. I don't know. I guess this. Um, and that's basically all what we're doing for this tutorial if you guys enjoyed the video and liked it uh, make sure to click the like button below as well as if you have any thoughts or questions or concerns please leave a comment below and I'll do my best to answer them I'll catch you guys later